Hello everyone and welcome to Driven Mad. Now today's video is a new type of video actually, I haven't done one like this before. This is me sitting down in the office chair. Um, I've cleared all the rubbish out of the way and I'm going to do a sit down video and basically explain how much we earn from our YouTube channel. Now before I started doing YouTube I thought that YouTubers even with anyone over a thousand subscribers earn a lot of money. and more and more as the years go by more people are putting things out about how much they earn and what have you and it's not as much as you would think so a lot of people if you want to you've probably been guessing how much you sort of we earn now our channel at this current moment has 2915 subscribers and we average around 30,000 views a month so it's not that many considering we have nearly 200 videos but um, it is quite interesting to look at and I thought it was just a good video to sort of explain and show how much we earn. So let's dive into my computer and we'll have a little look-see at our channel's studio. So as a lot of you know, we've recently changed our channel to Driven Mad. Now we changed this name because we thought the ignition wasn't really going anywhere. We thought we'd change the channel up a little bit and just sort of increase our quality and try and keep it to look a bit better. And I think the name change does that. Ignition Media was a little bit complicated because our name had a zero in it and I think it was just more difficult to find than it needed to be. So we've changed the name. Now if we hop onto our dashboard here, now I'm no expert at this, obviously I don't look at it that much, but we've got on the dashboard a quick summary of what the channel's been doing. So obviously we've got the latest video performance here and you can see that our views are 431. Um, and this has been up a few days now, so that's not brilliant, as a lot of you will see, compared to most people, that's really bad actually. But for us, 430 in a couple of days is quite good. So moving over to the side, we've got the channel analytics, and this is basically showing, you see it's saying, just a quick summary, 172 subscribers in the last 28 days. So YouTube does it in 28 days for the month as such, so it just keeps it going like that. And you can see our estimated revenue is 67 euros that's what they're predicting we're going to make this month so that's the month of october now if we dive down the side here you can see content and on here we've got one preparing we are driven mad at the moment which is going to go up it will be up when this video goes out and you can see it's just got a list of all of our content and it tells you how many comments how many views what date it was published and if monetization is on now you're not going to see many videos on here that aren't monetized because we make our videos uh, sort of friendly for advertisements to go on to because we want to make every penny we possibly can, as you can imagine why. So if we move down to analytics, we will hop over here. This is the most interesting section. This is the bit that explains sort of every bit in detail if you want it to. So if we head over to the views, you can see that we have in the last 28 days had 33,346 views. Now, that's actually pretty good for us. We've been sort of between the 28 and 30,000, so that's a few thousand more than usual. Obviously, the more videos we put up, the more views we're gonna get over time. Now, you can see our impressions over here. This is sort of how many people I think have seen the videos. Now, like I say, I'm not 100% an expert here but I think that's what it is, is how many people have seen our videos, not clicked on it, but actually how many people have seen it on YouTube come up. Now, that's 329,000. I wish we were getting 329,000 views <laughs> per month, but you can see on our last 28 days, we have had 33,000 views and we have generated 67 euros. Now, 67 euros a month is certainly not too bad considering we do this mainly for fun. Um, of course, we're gonna keep the monetization on to keep as much money as we can because quite frankly, why not? Um, subscribers, 172. Now, if we go over here and we click on our last 365 days, let's do a year. You can see from this moment on, exactly one year ago from now, we have had 331,000 views, so that's per year, right? That, that's the last year. Uh, obviously, watch time there is 16,456 hours, which is quite a long time, but obviously that's over all these people. Subscribers, we gained 1,500 in a year, and you can see, obviously, the graph, which I haven't mentioned, is different types of videos. These are our most popular. You can see our prop shaft video is doing exceptionally well. 37,000 views at the moment for the last year, which is brilliant. 
Uh, and you can see for the last year, our estimated revenue is set around 700 euros. So 700 euros is really not that bad. It would be nice to get to the point where 700 euros was coming in a month, but it is very, very interesting to see the money. Of course, when you start making money, you wanna keep making money. And it does really keep my interest high. Now moving along, you can see we've got traffic source. So this is gonna tell us the type of people who are watching, how the people found us and that sort of thing which is quite interesting. So YouTube search in the last year, 136,000 of our viewers out of 330,000 uh, found us by YouTube search. So that's quite a lot, really. 41% um, of our viewers to be exact. Then suggested videos. So once you watch a video, our video will pop up as a recommendation. That's 20% of our viewings. And then all the others are sort of almost an irrelevance uh, in comparison to those two main searches. Now you can see over the last year, impressions we've had 3.1 million. So if our videos actually looked good enough, theoretically 3.1 million people could have watched over the last year. Now in the comments below, please let us know what you think we could do better on our videos as we are totally open to criticism. Just uh, try and be a little bit nice, you know, we don't want to hurt the cat's feelings. And what we will do now is move over to things like viewer age. You can see mainly 35 to 45 year olds are watching. Obviously these are people who have accounts. If people are watching who don't have accounts then it's not going to be able to tell you their age. Now, if we head back out to our main analytics page, it gives you a little boost of confidence. It says channel views were up 29% in the last 28 days, exclamation mark. More people than usual have watched your videos from YouTube search results. So this is like, they sort of they sort of almost give you a positive message when you're doing well uh, to tell you what's actually doing better than usual. So you've got watch hours as well on the front page. You've got our subscribe account on the main page which actually is saying 32 more than usual so thank you to all our subs and we've got our estimated revenue now this is the one that everyone gets all excited about um, which I've already said I mean I'm not beating around the bush here the money isn't that important to me and my dad we mainly do it for fun of course we'll keep the monetization on because anything we can reinvest into the channel will make it better so if we head down to the estimated revenue this will give us a more detailed view of what's going down. So these are graphs of which video, you can see the color coordinated the videos to the graph. Now, it gives us basically the same as where we were, but it's telling us um, exactly where the revenue is coming from. So there's, there's YouTube premium. So people pay to not see adverts on YouTube. They'll pay monthly to get basically no ads, which is at it is quite appealing to me, but I wouldn't pay, I personally wouldn't pay £10 a month to not have adverts, it's just not worth it. And you can see, obviously YouTube will give us a bit of that, I suppose, because, I suppose, I, I wouldn't know why we get any money from that, but I'm guessing YouTube give back a little bit for taking off the advert revenue. Now, our main source is obviously regular adverts, and that's 66 euros. So, if we head back to 2021 this is last year this will give us a good little graph you can see we started monetization in roughly july the 13th to be exact and you can see this graph of how it gradually goes up now this is per day basically you can see on august the 28th we earn one euro 20 and as we're moving more towards the end of the year in december we are on this day three euros and 28 so triple now what tends to happen is in summertime the adverts aren't massively high and they pay a regular amount but obviously as it heads towards Christmas advertising goes up in price, more adverts are wanting to get on for Christmas things and usually December is our best month. We've only had one year of it so far which is 2021 through to this year but December as you can see by far is our best source. So if we move this now to lifetime you'll get the graph from December all the way back. So we begin, the graph's low, goes up in December, comes back down. Now that was a bit disappointing for me. I was enjoying watching it go up and then after Christmas it just started going back down and I couldn't understand why. And I did a bit of research into it and like I say, it's the advertising during Christmas period is a lot more expensive and there's more adverts, much higher demand. So it's coming back up actually at the moment, you can see into October, much higher than October last year. We're averaging about one to 150 a day and now we're on to 2, 250 a day. 
So since our time of uploading, we have earned a total of 842 euros and 19 cents. Now this gets paid through AdSense. So you have to have an AdSense account set up through your channel. Now, of course, YouTube talked you through the process of that. I had no idea how to do it and it was really simple. Just put in your bank details. You've got to fill in a couple of forms and that's basically it. Very easy to do. And the channel can only become monetized once you hit 1000 subscribers and you've had over 4000 watch hours of time on your content and i think your channel has to be over 30 days old as well i think that's something obviously most people aren't going to get that in 30 days it took us a over a year of uploading to get our thousand subscribers but at the moment it's actually going quite well that's pretty much all i have to say but i thought it was quite an interesting video as a channel who's got nearly 3000 subscribers but getting 30,000 views a month i've seen channels that have 1000 subscribers get one video with 100,000 views but obviously then their subscribers suddenly jump up but I thought this was quite a realistic sort of slow graph and slow example to show you how much a small channel like us earn now it's certainly better than the kick in the teeth but it's not so extravagant you know I mean when I was younger like I say I thought someone would if I'd looked at an account that had if I'd looked at a channel that had exactly the same stats as ours I would have guessed they were earning 500 a month maybe I thought ah, 500 a month is a bit you know that that's low but obviously my expectations were far too high now once I came to terms with the YouTube malarkey this really is the real side of it now we would earn a lot from sponsorships but we don't have any sponsorships I'd like some tool brands actually any tool brands who would like to sponsor us or give us some products to test please uh, drop us an email which is in the description and yeah that's enough of this video. Hopefully you found it interesting. I would have loved to have seen this before we began YouTube because I've only seen it on an extreme scale. I've only seen people with 2 million subscribers showing how much they earn and it's extortionate amount of money. But if you think for what we're doing, which is literally a few hundred views per video, this is really quite good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with this at the moment and hopefully it just keeps growing. But like I say, hopefully you found this interesting and you learned a little bit and maybe it's motivated you to start a YouTube channel. But this is the real scale of what we're working with, with 3,000 subscribers and 30,000 views a month. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Bit of a different one. And I will catch you in the next video. Hopefully it's an exciting car one.